kingdom of God. Hallelujah. You and I continuously. Amen. You know, there's no place to sit down and, and just give up. Hallelujah. We got to be continuously moving forward for the Lord. Glory to God. And producing good things, producing Amen. fruit. Amen. We all want to be a fruitful church, a fruitful uh, wife, a fruitful mother, amen, a fruitful husband as amen. well, raising a fruitful child of the King. Hallelujah. Yes, amen. amen. So she's faithful, uh, continuously going on, as this verse says. She will, she will do him good and not evil all the days of her life. Praise the Lord. And, and she seeketh wool, 13, and flax, and worketh willingly. With her hands, praise the Lord. Isn't that good? She she goes and, and just continuously, and she goes every length to work. Amen. And, and willingly with her hands. And, you know, there's no hint of laziness here in these verses. Did you have you caught that yet? Come on, amen. Amen. No, sir. No, it's just a continuous. You know that mother, Amen, that loves that child. Amen. Glory to God. She'll give her very life for her children. Amen. She'll fight every demon and devil in hell and whatever comes. Amen. To try to hurt those children and those babies of hers. Amen. She works tirelessly, faithfully. Amen. Continuously going on. You know, you and I should have that same passion and same love toward the work of God, toward Amen. our relationship with the Lord Amen. as well. Amen. And the next verse says, She is like the merchant's ships. She bringeth her food from afar. You know, amen. And this is speaking of, you know, if she if she if she if she if she buys something, she buys it with the idea and the mindset that she's going to take a little bit of that and use it, and then she's going to sell all the rest of it to pay for the little bit that she used. That's <laughs> amen. right. Amen. That's the right. Glory to God. It's not slothful. You know, one man said that, you know, a, a slothful woman can throw it out the back door faster than the man can throw it in the front. Amen. We, we've all heard those sayings. We know. Amen. But, but he says here, amen, that, that you know, she, she doesn't do like that. Not that virtuous woman. Not that precious saint. Not that precious saint of God. Amen. She's all the time up. <laughs> Looking and seeing how she can save and, and make things come together and work in that home. And, and you know, you and I must be the same way Amen. in the Amen. kingdom of God. Hallelujah. Right. Amen. Not casting our pearl before swine. Not no sir. Amen. Everything we do, amen, calculated towards doing what we can for the Lord. Amen. Because he's coming soon, church. Amen. How many believes he's coming soon? Amen. I mean, he wants to be ready when he comes back. Amen. 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 That husband comes Amen. back and that wife has, has adorned herself and she's made herself all just right. Amen. She's pretty herself just like on that wedding day. Amen. Everything hair's just right in order. Amen. All is pretty up. Amen. She's ready. Amen. Ready to spend the rest of her life with that thing, with that <laughs> husband. You and I. Amen. The same way. Waiting for the Lord Jesus to come back all the time, doing what we can. Anything the Lord sees in our life, he's not pleased with. Amen. We're wanting to get rid of that. We're wanting to be ready for his coming all the time, doing what we can. Amen. No, no laziness. Amen. Whatever we can do for the kingdom of God, we're ready to do it. Amen. Glory to God. Is that you this morning? Amen. Verse 15, she rises also while it is yet night. And giveth meat to her household and a portion to her maidens. Amen. So, amen. This this uh, virtuous woman, she takes the lead in guiding her house. And not only is it that, but she expects all of her house to follow that example that she's followed, that, that she has set. Amen. Glory be to God. Did you know amen. that you and I are to be in samples and examples? Amen. That virtuous woman, she leads her children. She raises them up in the fear and admonition of the Lord. Amen. She leads them towards Christ. Amen. Right. Thank God for all you precious well, Lord. Lord. out there that's raising your children up in, in, a, in a godly, God-fearing home. And you take them to church. Amen. You don't send them. No, that's not enough. You take them to church. Yeah, take right. them, yeah. amen, to Sunday school. Take them to, to worship God. And you pray with them. And you, and you spend time and teach them about the Word of God. Oh, thank God for a woman like that. Thank God for a mother like that. Amen. 
man that would teach you about the love of God. Glory be to God. And she expects all of those in the house to follow that example. Hallelujah. That's a wonderful verse. Amen. Glory to God. Uh, verse 16 says, She considereth the field and buyeth it. With the fruit of her hands, she plants, planteth a vineyard. Amen. You know, she's constantly planning on how to provide for her family. Have Come on now, amen. Amen. Glory to God. You know, we're not going to have but a, but, a, but a spoonful of this and a cup full of that. Oh. Amen. But she's going to make it work somehow or another. Amen. amen. Come on, somebody. Amen. amen. She's looking ahead. She knows what, what's oh, got yeah. to be done to meet that need. Glory to God. Got them hungry babies. It's going to need to be fed. Whatever needs to be done, she's going to take amen. care of it. Oh. Amen. They're not going to go hungry. Come on. How many Come mothers out there can identify with me this morning? Yeah. Them babies are going to be took care of. Amen. Glory to God. Yeah. Did you know that we're called to be Christians in the same manner? Well, Amen. Lord. To look out. We are our brother's keeper. Yes. Yes. Amen. We are to look out for our brothers and our sisters yes. and love yes. them and help them yes. lead them towards the Lord. Bless yes. the Lord yes. this morning. Yes. Amen. I'm just going to go real quick through this. 17. She girdeth her loins with strength and strengtheneth. Her arms, amen. She keeps herself and her family amen. in good health, amen. She That's takes right. care of herself, doesn't let herself go, amen, all the time taking care of herself because she's got somebody else she's got to take care of, amen, and she can if she's not in order, Lord. amen, but all the time seeing about her. Everything's in order, taking care of her family. They've got the proper food, nutrition that they need. Come Amen. on, brother. They're Amen. in health. They're taking care of their family. Amen. That those babies are took care of. Amen. They're not, not sick. She don't just let them stay sick and die. Amen. But she tends to it and takes care of that situation. You and I again, once Come more, on, we are called to be the same servants of yeah. one another. Yeah. When we see a brother and a sister, Hallelujah. when we see a brother and a sister, amen, that's doing Thank without you, Lord, and being hurting, when we see somebody out there yeah. in the world, we should have that compassion. Yeah. Them. Yeah. I want to help them, I want to encourage them, and lift them up and help them towards yeah. the Lord. Glory to God. Thank you, Lord. She is our help. Thank you, Jesus. Yeah. Hallelujah. Amen. She perceiveth that her, I'm going to read a couple of verses. She perceiveth that her merchandise is good. Her candle goeth not out by night. She layeth her hands to the spindle, and her hands hold the distaff. And she stretcheth out her hand to the poor. Yea, she reacheth forth her hands to the needy. Glory to God. Amen. Amen. That virtuous woman. Amen. She's not weary and well doing. <laughs> oh, bless the Lord. Glory I said, God. She's not weary and well doing. Amen. All the time wanting to reach out and help somebody in need. Help the poor. Help the needy. Bless the Thank Lord. Thank you, Lord. And, you know, this this would be a, a, a very foreign message to them people in the world out there. Amen. 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 Never would they understand. They would look crazy at it at a message like this. Amen. But I tell you, not to the virtuous woman. That's Amen. Right. Not to that woman that's in love with Jesus. That's right. Amen. Not to that Boy, bride of Christ. Amen. We know and we understand a message like this. That's right. We are to be concerned for the lost. We are to be concerned for the hurting. We are to have compassion upon those that are in need. Amen. Those that are poor and hurting out there and dying in the world. Amen. No, they don't care. Amen. Because they don't know anything about that love that my sister was teaching about this morning. Amen. But that love that comes from God Almighty. That God that feeds your heart. Amen. Because he cares for others. That means it's in you now. And you care for others. But see, he's not in them. So they have no compassion. The only real love comes from God. God is And if they don't have God in their heart, they don't have the love in their heart. They right, 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 right. thank God we realize we can understand a message like this this morning. We have compassion for yes, those that are in need. Hallelujah. 21 says she is not afraid of the snow for her household, but for all her household are clothed with scarlet. Amen. Bless the Lord. You know, she's she's she, she's planned for the winter. Amen. 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 She's already thought ahead. She's already yeah. 
You know, it's, it, here comes a snow. Man, cold winter. Hey, man, everybody else is, oh, what are we going to do? I'm that virtuous woman. She's already took care of the situation. She's got clothes. She's been stitching all through the summer. Hey, man, she knows winter's coming. Hey, man, she's got the clothes made hey, for the kids. Them babies is ready to go. She even made an extra one for Johnny next door. Hey, hey man, man, somebody. Hey, man, she's interested in and helping and loving folks and, and taking care. She doesn't sit around slothful and lazy. Hey, man, only a selfish person. Oh, sir, not that virtuous one. Not on your mind. Hey, man, she's all the time. Hey, man, moving constantly, doing what she can for others and for the Lord. And for her family, glory be to God this morning. Amen. Thank 22. You, Lord. She maketh herself coverings of tapestry. Her clothing is silk and purple. Hallelujah. Amen. She doesn't skimp on taking care of herself. Amen. I tell you, it's important to take care of yourself. Yeah. Glory, Amen. God. glory to God. And her home. Amen. But however, we got to realize money is not her God. It's not her God. She don't worship money. Amen. She doesn't praise money. She doesn't adore money. She just realizes that money it takes money. Amen. To keep this house going and to keep the work of God going. Amen. So she does what's needed and keeps things going like they should be. Hallelujah. Glory oh, God. Bless God this morning. Amen. Amen. These are some wonderful verses. Amen. No doubt we could spend six months going through these Amen. little slower. Amen. Amen. But 23, her husband is known in the gates when he sitteth among the elders of the land. Amen. You know, that, that speaks volumes right there. You know, that, that virtuous woman, she doesn't grab the first bill or Henry that comes along. Amen. Come on. Amen. She didn't grab the first man that comes along. Amen. The first loser. Hello. Lord Amen. God. Amen. Come on. She, she sings the Lord. And she cries out to God and says, God, I, don't want, I need a husband. But God, I don't want the first thing that comes along. I'm not going to jump in the sack or something. Amen. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to keep myself Lord, for you. And God, I'm waiting for the right husband. Yes, come along. Amen. amen. And I'm praying, God, send me the right one. Hallelujah. The one that you want me to have. Lord. Amen. Come on, somebody. Amen. Oh, Many people have got into trouble because they got a hit of God. Amen. 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 But this verse said that she 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 found the right one. Hallelujah. Amen. She found the one that cares about her. Amen. Glory to God. Not just cares about her body. Amen. But cares about her. Glory to God. Amen. She doesn't grab the first thing that won't lie. She prayed and she got herself a good man. Amen. She got one that was a leader in the community. Hallelujah. Come on, somebody. Amen. Amen. I'm talking about a virtuous woman this morning. Amen. I'm talking about a woman in love with Jesus. Hallelujah. Amen. I'm talking about a woman that's really? filled with the love of God. Glory be to God. She's in love with him. Therefore, she is in love with others. You know, I, I'll tell you this morning, if you husbands, you want to be a better husband to your wife, the very first way that you can do it is you get in love with Jesus. Oh, come on. And you put Jesus before that wife. Amen. Women, if you want to be a better wife to your husband, you put Jesus before that husband. You begin to put that husband first, and you'll be the most terrible wife you could have ever been. And if you'll put Jesus first, amen, then you'll treat him far better than he could have ever expected. Far better than he could have ever dreamed and imagined. He'll be treated like a king. Hallelujah. Why? Because the love of God will be in you. Amen. And because he'll be being loved like God would love him. And she'll be being loved like God loved him. Her. Hallelujah. Amen. Because he'll be in you. And he'll be first in your life. Thank you, Lord. Amen. Praise yes. the Lord. Praise, God. Praise the Lord. 24. Strength and honor are her clothing. And she shall rejoice in time to come. Let's see. I'm reading the wrong one. She, she maketh fine linen and selleth it. And delivereth girls unto the merchant. Amen. You know, she her husband is a leader in the community. But she's no lesser in the community than he is. 
She's capable of running a business. Amen. We're talking about a virtuous woman here. Mm -hmm. Amen. We're talking about that a decision maker. Hallelujah. Come on now. Yeah. Amen. Amen. 25. The sea of strength and honor are her clothing, and she shall rejoice in time to come. Amen. Yeah. Hallelujah. You know, all that, that she makes is done with quality. Praise the Lord. She, she doesn't sham nothing together. Amen. Everything she does. She does right. She does right. it with all her heart. She does it when it is a quality product. When that virtuous woman gets through with something. <laughs> oh, bless the Lord. Amen. Everybody wants her goods. Everybody knows what sort kind of job she's going to do. Everybody sees. Amen. Oh, my goodness. I want that. Amen. Because. Amen. That, that's why right there. Amen. The Lord God is first. Amen. He's leading that virtuous woman. Hallelujah. Strength and honor are her clothing, and she shall rejoice in her time to come. Yeah. Amen. And, and so she openeth her mouth with wisdom, and her tongue is the law of kindness. Amen. Amen. Uh, amen. Her tongue is not harsh. Amen. It's not harsh. Amen. It's kind. Amen. Those words that come out are kind. Hallelujah. Oh, don't forget this one. We're talking about the Thank you, Lord Jesus. We're talking about all of us in here that name Christ as our Savior, as our Lord, as our husband. Hallelujah. Amen. That's the way that we conduct ourselves. Glory to God. 27. She looketh well to the ways of her household and eateth not the bread. Of idleness. Holy. Even though this precious saint is greatly blessed, yes. there's, she's got all everything she took care of. Greatly blessed, highly favored. Still, there's no time for idleness. Amen. Oh, come on. The work must continue. Amen. 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 How many of us in here? My, my, my. We could preach a lot right here. Yes. Amen. How many of us? We, we, we get blessed. God really blesses us and great things come in. All of a sudden we get a little slack. All of a sudden we get a little lazy. All of a sudden we're not so concerned with going to the Lord's house anymore. Amen. Then the heat gets turned up and we run back to the Lord again. Amen. Amen. But that, not that virtuous woman. Not that woman that's in love with Jesus. Oh, not that mother that's put God first in her family. Not oh, that family that's put God first. Hallelujah, above their job. Amen. Come on now. Not oh, that one that's in love with God. Oh, sir, the work must continue the work of God. Amen. Not slack. Not weary and well doing. Her children rise up. I'm just going to finish this out. Her children rise up and call her blessed. Her husband also, and he praiseth her. Amen. Amen. Many daughters have done virtuously, but thou excellest them all. Thank you, Lord. Favor is deceitful, and beauty is vain, but a woman that feareth the Lord, she shall be praised. Amen. Amen. Give her of the fruit of her hands, and let her own works praise her in the gates. Hallelujah. Yes. Praise Thank the Lord. Amen. These these verses just they speak for themselves this morning. Yeah. Yeah. You know, but that, that last verse there spoke of, of the fruit. And I and I, I thought of something just was it yesterday, the day before yesterday. And I said, Well, I've got to share that with the church. Thank you. I say I thought of something. Bless the Lord. Bless Amen. Amen. Put something in my heart. Amen is, is the way I should say it. Amen. You know, most of you know that we raise a lot of fruit there at our place, blueberries, and different things. That just, just, oh, it's just the whole crop is filled up with, with this type of stuff. And uh, went out through the blueberry patch the other day, and, and you all know that we're in a in a real dry time right now. Amen. It's, it's been a few weeks since we saw any rain. You know, somebody else might have got one. We didn't get one up here. That's, that's generally how it goes up there around our place. And uh, you know, I've got I've got some waters that's that's set up on all of these trees and some bushes that's out there. And, you know, but it's it's in times of of dryness. 
You know, we, we've got to have the moisture. Amen. 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 You know, speaking of the river that flows from God out of heaven. Hallelujah. We've got to have that spirit flowing. And you know, it's, it's in those times of, of dryness and in times of storms, times of, of pains. And, and, you know, it's in those times that, that we just need a little extra moisture. Amen. Amen. Glory to God. You know, I looked out across them uh, bushes just the other day, and I and I and I noticed I hadn't been out there in about a week. I looked out there and I saw where those Dale and Marys they were like that, and, and now all of a sudden there's a lot of them just shriveled up like that. Amen. What's going on? It's getting dry. Amen. You know, I, I got that water turned on. Comes on every other day out there, but but it only come on for a certain amount of time. <laughs> that was good back when we was getting the rain every week. Right. Amen. But when you get into a place in a time when you don't have no rain now for three weeks or so in a row, maybe longer than that now. Right. Right. Amen. That little bit of water every now and then doesn't help. It. No, no. So what we find is the first thing that happens is those bushes goes into a into a kind of a self preservation mood. Right. Right. And I'm going to tell you this morning that you and I are the same way when we get kind of a little dry and we get away from the Spirit of God and the movement of the Spirit. And we tend to get a little lazy maybe in our seeking the Lord and haven't sought the Lord. And maybe we're going through troubles or whatever, what have you. And we've gotten away from the altar. We've forsaken the altar. Amen. And what happens is... Amen. We tend to go into a self-preservation mode. Come on, amen. Oh, amen. We, you know, and, and the next thing that happens is the fruit goes. Yeah. Amen. Amen. That's what that bush will do. That's the first thing that happens. It says, I'm going to survive through this, so I'm going to drop the fruit. First thing that goes, the fruit falls off. Amen. The leaves are still fluttering. They're still green. Hello, somebody. Amen. But there's no fruit being brought forth. Come on, somebody. Amen. Amen. You see, what in the world are you talking about, preacher? I'm talking about a saint that begins to get a little dry in their spirit. And they haven't sought the Lord as they should. Amen. And they're not getting into the river like they should. And they've forsaken the altar. They've forsaken the Lord's house as they should. And they begin to get dry. Amen. And all yeah. once the first thing you see is self begins to get right. much important. Amen. Amen. And the fruit falls to the ground. There's no more fruit being brought forth. No more concern for anybody else. No more concern for the work of God. Amen. Only concern for me and myself. Amen. That's just exactly what's going on in that blueberry bush. Yeah. The fruit's shriveling up and it's falling off. Yet the leaves still look pretty. Hello, somebody. Oh, we still dance around. Oh, we will still jump and shout. We still look in the part. Hello. Oh, this ought to go straight into your soul this morning. I said we still look the part. Amen. The leaves are still pretty. Fluffing in the wind. Amen. But the fruit is all to the ground. Amen. We're to be a fruitful people, church. Yes. Amen. You'll know them by the fruit. Hallelujah. Oh, Amen. Sometimes it's all right to be a fruit inspector. First thing, we need to inspect our own fruit. What kind of fruit am I bringing for? Yes. What kind of fruit am I bringing for to the kingdom of God? What am I doing for the Lord and the kingdom? Glory to God. Or has my fruit fallen to the ground and I'm just the pretty leaves flapping around? Hallelujah. Amen. Church, if I was to turn that moisture off completely out there, it wouldn't be very long until you could see the leaves that begin to fall out of it. That's right. Amen. 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 So, you know, it's, it's real, it's not that hard to take a look. I say, Lord, I say it every time I pray, Lord. Probe into the depths of my soul. Yes. God, look, just dig around. 
God, show me where I am. Lord, show me where I fell. Lord, show me where I need to be. Jesus. Amen. Amen. You know, we can look at ourselves and we can pray, Lord, look at me. God, show me, Lord, where I stand with you. Where am I at today, Lord? God, am I bringing forth fruit? Or is my fruit like them trees up there right now? Is it shriveled up and unsightly? And it's just an eyesore to look at. Amen. Or am I bringing forth fruit that will bless somebody else? Am I bringing forth fruit that will bless my husband, that will bless my wife, that will bless my church, that will bless my children, that will bless the next door neighbor? Amen. What am I doing? Am I bringing forth fruit? Amen. Or am I just dancing around and still playing the part waiting to die? Come on now. Because the next thing to go is to leave. That's right. Amen. Thank you. Where are you at this morning? Come on, man. Amen. If you kicked into self preservation mode, amen. Or do you see fruit just in the God's hold for others? To, Thank you, Lord. To feast on. Amen. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Dear God in heaven. Yes, Lord. Lord, I pray this morning, Lord, that God, this message, I know it's. And kind of scattered this morning, Lord. But I believe you've ordained this today, God. And Lord, I ask right now as I come to the closing of this message and this service that you would look into the hearts, that you would probe, oh Jesus, in the depths of our soul. God, that you would look around. Lord God, that we would see. Open our eyes, Jesus. That we could see, Lord, where we are. Lord, are we bringing forth much fruit? Are we in the vine? Lord God, are we just leaves? Flat around. Where do we stand, Lord? Show us this morning. And help us, Lord, to make things right right here, right now. Mother's Day, 2018. Lord God, let us be on fire for you. Lord, let the river of God flow through us, Lord, from this day forth as never before. Use us for your glory. God, I thank you for this. In Jesus' name, amen. 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 This, this altar is open right now. I want you to come. I want you to come this morning. Let's let God do some restoration to you, Daniel. Let's let him do some restoration this morning. Oh, God. Heart. Hallelujah. Why don't you come this morning, baby? Amen. Let God fill your soul up. Let 